Hey Pisces, this is Dana with Taurus Star Tarot and we are about to do a reading for your sign today. This is a speed read. This is not my normal reading. This is something that's going to go very, very quickly. It's a very short uh, Valentine's Day kind of reading. It's about love, okay? So this is a speed read about love for Pisces. I want to address what we have on the board already. What we already have is um, all the signs of the Minor Arcana. We have water, we have air, we have earth, and we have fire. What else do we have on the board as far as major arcana? We have Capricorn with the devil, we have uh, justice, we have Libra, we have uh, the moon card, which is either Pisces or Cancer, depending upon your philosophy, and uh, the emperor being Aries. We also have the chariot on the board. The chariot is the sign of, what is the chariot? Cancer. The sign of cancer. So that being said, let's just go through these cards real quick and give you a little boost mid-month for Valentine's Day. We start out this reading with conflict. There is conflict and challenge in regards to having an inspired new beginning with another. Directly related to coming together and engaging with another person to, to build something. The Eight of Pentacles to the Eight of Pentacles. So there is conflict and a challenge in regards to a new beginning, an inspired new beginning with somebody um, that you want to come together and engage with and build something with. The Three of Wands says you have been waiting on this for a good minute. The Devil card comes in and says that there is a blockage because of the Five of Swords. There is conflict. You are up in your head in the Eight of Swords in a self-imposed mental restriction overthinking this entire situation. The Nine of Swords comes in and says, not only are you overthinking the situation, but you are uh, caught up in the situation and you can't seem to, you can't seem to, um, to stop thinking about it, right? Over here with the Queen of Swords, you make a decision. While you're in this Nine of Swords and Eight of Swords, you make a decision with the Queen of Swords. This decision is about your pursuit of the Ten of Cups, harmony, happiness, and values alignment in your life and or marriage. The emperor comes in and says that this is directly related to the security and the foundation of your life. Chariot comes in and says that you are yet you are willing. You have the willpower, the control, and the determination to move forward and take whatever action is necessary to achieve your success. Justice comes in on top of it and says you are justified in this decision-making process right here. This is truth, fairness, cause and effect, and law. The hermit comes in. You're still in your head just a little bit for a minute, giving it one last good think, doing some soul searching and some introspection before you actually move forward with the chariot card. What you're thinking about in this hermit mode is the queen of pentacles and the king of pentacles. You are thinking about um, coming together as a couple with another person. The pentacles, remember, earth energy. This is all about home, wealth, family, establishment, security, right? So you are, are doing some soul searching and some introspection about coming together with another to create a life. Moon card says that you are squinting through that window of life, trying to figure out exactly the course of action that you should take. This is all about the Six of Cups reconciling or reuniting with somebody from your past. A love relationship. The World card comes in and says there's going to be a completion, an integration, and an accomplishment in your endeavor right here. One life cycle is going to end and a new life cycle is going to begin for you. This new life cycle is going to bring you wishes, fulfilled comfort, happiness, and satisfaction. There you go, Pisces. That was your speed read for Valentine's Day. If you'd like a personal reading, you can hit me up at TaurusStarTarot.com. 40 bucks for all of my YouTube subscribers. If you liked this, please like it, please subscribe, and please share. Namaste.